Okay guys, so yeah, welcome to another video and today we are going to be doing like I would say a tutorial um on the Christmas events and also just hunting around for another big Rudolph and also just completing the event missions. So yeah, hopefully that goes well and I'll get you guys out there. Okay guys, um, yeah, I finally found a male lynx, and as you guys can hear, I did pick up the e-caller attachment for the lynx, as I promised I would. But yeah, I was walking around, and then this guy called, so I'm pretty sure that's him. Yeah, he's coming in from the direction that he, or that the male called, so I do hope that this is the male that called under otherwise I might be spooking him by shooting this one but yeah we're just gonna shoot it either way and he's done nice so we'll pick up my e-caller and go pick him up okay so this is indeed the male that called so that's a good thing um, I'm assuming that's a low weight but yeah, it's a little guy, 9.7. I was about to say, they do weigh quite a bit more than Bobcats as far as my knowledge goes. I think they go up to 55. I don't know for, for sure, so please don't hold me to that, guys. So, ooh, 250, 243 bolt, action rifle harvests. And that puts me into... What comp is that? But anyways, that mission is done, so, um, uh, wait, that's a different mission. <laughs> there we go. There is our mission objective complete, so, I think we need a fox and a moose now, so, that shouldn't be too tough, even though I haven't been doing too well with the moose, but yeah, the fox shouldn't be too tough, so, let's go get that. Okay, guys, so, yeah, I thought since I am sitting here in the tower, waiting for um, the fox that I need for m for my mission um, yeah the fox is the only thing I need and knowing my luck it's probably gonna take until the last day until I get that fox so yeah I am taking this opportunity to speak to you guys more in detail about the event so yeah there is four trophies I believe no there are five trophies um, the one is just for the 2020 present dollars, and then if you get 2020 present dollars, present dollars, then you get 200 EMs and a resume mission streak card, um, but that you only get at the end of the event if you made it above 2020 present dollars. And then the other, or the one after that is if you finish top 10 in the event, I'm not too sure what you get for that. And then the next one after that is third and second and first. So those are the five trophies that you can win. Each one you get a bigger prize for getting. And then also, um, the easiest ways I would say of making, or I'll actually just run through all of the ways you can make present dollars. I will throw a picture up on screen about that um yeah you can get 500 present do present dollars for completing the missions so the missions are actually quite easy um it's just a, as i said 620 plus willow ptarmigan um a 22 plus red fox a 160 plus roe deer which i did forget that 150 plus moose 24 plus brown bear 8 plus Eurasian Lynx and then a 420 plus um, Rudolph. So that's also not too difficult at all. Um, I'd say reindeer average about 400. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure, and that's just that female calling again. Um, but yeah, the 420 Rudolph is not too difficult. And you also obviously just need to spot a Rudolph, and for that, you obviously get the 500 prison points, prison dollars. And then you get a trophy, searching for Rudolph trophy. Then you get a tree stand. I'm not sure if, I think it's the double tree stand, but I am not sure. So, 
um, yeah, it just says tree stand under that, so we'll have to wait and see what we get for that, and I'll obviously put a, a picture of that on the screen, uh, or picture of the missions, and then you get 5,000 GMs for completing the missions, so that's also a very nice um, prize for completing the missions, I think, yeah, the werewolf event, you got 666 GMs, which was not that rewarding, um, so I'm very happy with this, so once again, the devs have done a good job, and also the missions, they're very nice, instead of having to pick up collectibles and stuff, you, you can, um, or you have to shoot animals for the missions, so I really enjoyed that a lot, so, yeah, once again, I take my hat off to the devs for doing a great job. Um, qualifying in one of the competitions and now in the competitions I'll also throw a picture of that up on the screen soon um, yeah the competitions there are five competitions so the first one is obviously finished now so that's unfortunate that I'm making the video after it's completed it was the, the um, dogs truly ethical red stag challenge which is highest scoring red deer stag at 100% harvest value and yeah so that's obviously finished and then the next one which is starting today I'm sure is the king yes it started today king of the mule deer you need to harvest the highest scoring mule deer with a 7 mm rifle 7 millimeter rifle out of a hunting tower so yeah that's going to be an interesting one and then also, uh, I think the one after that will be Five Elegant Elks, which we obviously don't know at this stage what that competition is going to be about. And also, each of these competitions run for three days, so that's nice. And yeah, then after the Five Elegant Elks, it's Tim, uh, Tremendous Turkey, sorry. And then after Tremendous Turkey, big boxing bears so all they all sound interesting and I look forward to doing them or competing in them and also now you get uh, 200 present dollars for competing in just one of those so but you just have to place you don't have to place top 10 place top 20 place top 5 anything you can come last and you'll get those 20 or 200 present present dollars and as far as I know from the sheet as you guys have seen it says qualify in one holiday so I think you only get 200 once off I don't think you get 200 for each one so yeah and then obviously for shooting a Rudolph red nosed reindeer you get 50 present dollars and harvesting any land animal so any land animal on any map doesn't have to be on Hemeldoll, and there's a fox coming in, so maybe we can get lucky with that. But yeah, um, uh, for harvesting any land animal on any map, so for instance, this fox that's a, a 5 to 15 male, so that could be promising, and he's walked in all the way. But yeah, any land animal, any map is five present dollars. Any bird, any bird, yes, if you harvest any bird, so um goose, duck, anything, you get two present dollars because obviously it's a lot easier to shoot a lot more of them and then the presents that you can collectible presents uh, let me just shoot this fox because it seems the call has worn off, that was not the best shot but I don't want to mess that up because that might finally be my mission done uh, let's mark him, he's over there so yeah, for a green present, you get one to two present dollars, and then for a blue present, you get two to three present dollars, and a red present, three to four, purple present, five to six, silver present, six to eight, and then finally golden present, you get eight to ten present dollars. So yeah, um, I wouldn't say the presents, present collectibles are the easiest way to make present dollars I'd say just hunting around any map would be easiest and then obviously uh, placing in that competition is a free 200 present dollars and obviously R Rudolph um, 50 they aren't the rarest but I'd say on average you can get two or three a hunt 
effect so yeah that's a thing but yeah that's more or less everything i have to say about that um i hope you guys all have a great christmas and festive season you guys must stay safe and also congratulations to the devs for this great competition or this great event and the creative competition so far i've liked them a lot um yeah i take my hat off to them it's a lot of work and they've done a great job with this event um yeah that's more or less everything i have to say on that so we'll go find this fox and i'll bring you guys back then well this guy definitely didn't go far for a body shot uh i'm not, I'm not going to be too optimistic oh he's not heavy man i hate my fox luck yep 19.5 so <laughs> uh, at least we could get some talking in there so the fox grind continues so yeah as you guys can see i've been painting the map um but yeah it's only 12 12,900 meters so yeah we can do better <laughs> okay nice we've got a silver tip coming in um yeah i just thought i'd come check out my bear barrel since it is on my reindeer route so i thought i will come and check that out and that was a bad shot she started walking um we should be able to get a follow up oh, and she moved again and stupid bear oh well we are going to have to wait for her to die it looks like it was an intestine shot so not the best shot ever but yeah she will go down okay so um yeah luckily the silver tip didn't go far and there we go silver tip um yeah unfortunately a tiny little female 17.2 um yeah, I mean, it's still trophy shot worthy. A rare is a rare. Okay, so I thought I'd just have some fun with this trophy shot since it's just a small female. And, yeah. <laughs> just a little bit of fun. Uh, I can't move my character for some other reason now. Uh, okay, there we go. Just want to get him a bit more in frame. Yeah, I thought I'd have some fun with it since it's just a little female. So, yeah. Uh, I don't think that looks too bad. And accept and sell. Now I've got a bigger, well, I think it's a 24 scoring um, male silver tipped. So, yeah, that's a nice little surprise. Okay, so we're going to try and get the shot in. I think this link is going to spot me before I get a shot, but I'm going to try. Nice, down. Okay, good. I did not think I'd be able to pull that off since links are so skittish but yeah i did forget my 243 but i mean i've got the bow with me for a reason right and let us see what this guy scores male decent weight let us see 10.3 it's a decent little guy <clears throat> i would like to get a um 11 plus but 10.3 is a good start so yeah let's get a trophy shot of him okay yeah i don't think that looks too bad not at all so let's take that picture right there actually i am just going to do this because it's irritating me that my characters are not looking at the camera so yeah that's a decent links down and let's see what else we can get since this hunt seems to be going well if I'm being completely honest, this guy doesn't even look like a reindeer with that width. I've never seen a reindeer that wide, but let's hope that's a good thing, right? Uh, yeah. I have been spotted. And the wind took that shot a bit. That's not good. Oh well, it's just a female, right? So, <laughs> Doc's going to be angry with me, but I don't really want to waste time on a female reindeer. When I have this guy down, um, yeah, he does look pretty decent. I'm gonna say mid 500s. I'm going to regret guessing him. Nah, he's got broken tops. I'm gonna go with 520, 510 to 520. I'd say. Moment of truth. 
Uh, yep, 5.10 to 5.20. I'm going to take a trophy shot just because um, it's such a cool looking rack. And it's a Rudolph. Anyways. But yeah, it's got a very cool looking rack. So that's why I'm going to be taking that picture. Okay, I've taken way too long with this trophy shot just for a 5.12. But, I mean, it looks okay. I tried a lot of different poses and nothing was working. So yeah, I had to settle for that. Okay guys, this is going to be quick paced. Um, if I can get a shot off. Got him, nice. Okay, that is a big moose. Um, sorry. Sorry, Binky. Uh, <laughs> I think I hit a trophy tree there. Nice. Uh, let's go find him. So, yeah. Um, in the beginning of the hunt, I found a 550 to 620 track and I got distracted, so I lost him. And yeah, I regret doing that now because this guy was also 550 to 620, but yeah, 199, so <laughs> not as big as I thought he would be or hoped he would be actually. But yeah, I might try and find those tracks with that other moose somehow, but yeah. That's at least a decent moose down. Okay guys. Um, I'm not going to risk this with the bow, so... Oh, sure. But... Yeah, he's not huge. I just saw his tops, so... Just wanted to take the shot as quickly as possible. But yeah, that's a... Um, just a common little guy. He's got an interesting rack on him. He's got... It looks like... Three out of his four paddles? No, he's only got two. Uh, that's going to hurt him a lot. And he's almost max weight. So that max weight track was worth it. 439. Huh. Oh well. <clears throat> I was right with the max weight part, but not the <laughs> max score part. So yeah. We'll just carry along the road and see what else we can find. Okay, um, so yeah, that was a pretty decent hunt. I am at least very happy with the silver tip bear that we managed to get. And we got most of the missions done, or most of the mission objectives done. We still have to get a 22 plus red fox. And I honestly thought it would take me longer to get an 8 plus lynx, but apparently my fox luck um, doesn't want me to get a 22 plus fox I think I've shot like 10 fox in the last two days and all of them have been under 19 so yeah not the best fox luck but we'll see if we can get that completed and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys in the next one